Welcome to Baritone Call. We took a little break there for a minute, but we're back guys. And on tonight's video, we're gonna show you the Seymour Duncan 805 Overdrive pedal. Cause we're gonna demo it for you, but this video is basically about adding a second overdrive into your signal chain. So our sound tonight, we'll get right into it, is this. Here's our bass that we're working with. And then I'll click the pedal on, I'm gonna move some dials, and I'm gonna tell you what I'm doing on the pedal. If you're just playing with one overdrive, I'm telling you guys, man, a lot of you probably aren't. A lot of you probably have a couple of them. Check this out, here's the sound. <laughs> So that's our bass sound that we're working with. And I'm gonna click this on over here. The reason I wanted to do a demo of the Seymour Duncan 805 is because I like the pedal and I think it's worth having in your arsenal. Along with the level and drive dials, you also have your treble, your mid, and your bass dials to fine tune it. When I'm trying to dial a sound in, or maybe like you guys are, I'll usually go in really small increments, okay? So here's our bass sound. Let's click the pedal on. And I'm gonna set both dials at noon. So you guys all know it tightens your sound up a little bit. So we're gonna click it back on and we're gonna mess with it. We're gonna put the level at three quarters up and we're gonna put the gain or the drive at about a quarter up. Let's put the level all the way up. And we'll put the gain, drive, whatever you want to call it. We'll put that right in the middle, so 50%. Here's without the pedal. All right, let's click this baby on again. And we're gonna put the level at 50% and we're gonna put the drive at 75%. Too much drive. So we're gonna put the drive at about 40%. And we're gonna put the level at 75. A lot of times you hear about with an overdrive, crank the level all the way up and a little bit on the gain. We got about 75% level and maybe 40% gain. Now we're going to 
gonna click the level all the way up, and we're gonna turn the gain all the way down. <laughs> Okay, now you've got the level and the gain. You've got the three knobs, which is gonna be your mini EQ, whatever you wanna call it, which is your mid, your treble, and your bass. So here's this lick one more time. Now we're gonna take that bass and we're gonna dial that all the way down. So I wanna see if there's a big contrast. Let's turn it back up and we're going to hit that bass about 60, about 60%, 60 so just over halfway. Let's turn it back down again. All right, so let's turn that right up in the middle. You know, it seems to me like those, the EQ on there is definitely a great option to fine tune it. Um, there's a lot of overdrive pedals out there and having an EQ section is really nice. It's beneficial to dial in your sound. I'm actually making some big adjustments. And so what's gonna be helpful for you guys is, is to do you, stay in your own lane, get your own sound. But what I do, um, I'll make little adjustments when I'm really trying to fine tune something in. So if you're adding a second pedal into your pedal chain, make big jumps if you want. But when you're really trying to dial it in, just it's those little small adjustments. So I'm going to go put this right at the middle. I'm going to put the gain and the level right at 50%. The EQs are basically all about 50%. <laughs> We are gonna back this gain off. We're gonna put that gain at about 30%. And I'm gonna put the level at about 60. So I'm going to take that drive and I'm going to put that down and I'm going to lower that bass a little bit. I'm going to put that level up a little bit. So we got our level about 75%, maybe 25% on our drive. <laughs> I'm going to drop that bass all the way off. All right, guys. Well, anyways, there's some sounds from the Seymour Duncan 805. 
And uh, I think it's a good pedal. I think it's worth it. If, you, if you're looking for another overdrive that you kind of like to fine tune the EQ, I'm sure you could grab a used one and uh, it's, a it's a pedal worth trying out. It's a, it's a keeper for me, so I figured I'd do a video of it. And uh, this week's band is Pertubator. Got the James face. So this is some like synth wave music. Maybe a little more popular three or four or five years ago, but I really dig it. I'd like to do some music like that along maybe with some metal stuff, but um, yeah, I hope you guys been doing good. Thanks for tuning in. You know, thanks for all the thumbs up and support. And we're back. We'll have a video this week. We'll have another one next week. And um, you guys stay awesome. Thank you.